my phone ding great during my intro. Lovely. <laughs> Welcome back to Subsistence Design Like a Boss. And today, oh, maybe I should say this is episode 11 too. So today we are going to go out, do some grinding. At the end of the episode, I hope to be able to go ahead and make the power um, storage unit, the battery guy. Shut off our lights. That one was off. Good enough. And my ace in the hole for crafting is kind of in this guy over here. So let's shut that light off. And between the two of them, hopefully one of them has 500 power. Alright, let's get going. Let's get going on this. <coughs> See what we can come up with. I did craft a shotgun shell and I am crafting arrows because we need some food like always. Let's check everything out and see what goodies the box crate fairy has left for us around. Couple of wolves over there, doesn't have that direction like normal. Sometimes it's just prudent to yield to their will. Special thanks to Papa Rob, who has been giving me some really great advice on uh, how to do well in this game. So thank you, Papa Rob. He's been commenting on absolutely every video. Very helpful. Go check his channel out. Uh, I might, if I remember, I will throw a link to his channel in the description. He is what we call a good old boy. Alright, we're going to grind up a little wood, because why not? Must be done. I want to get back into doing some more building as well, so... Ooh, there's a crate. Skip the wood when you see a crate. Always a good idea. Anyways guys, if you guys are enjoying this Let's Play series of subsistence, make sure you give me a big fat thumbs up, and if you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It really helps guys. It really, really helps. There's another creep, but I thought I heard a growl, but I guess I did not. Sometimes I can't hear the growling over the sound of my own voice. So we'll take this. Thank you very much. Ah, nice. Did I mention already I was able to craft up one more shotgun shell? Ooh, Mr. Bear's over there. Leave him be. There's a wolf over there as well. Mr. Wolf. Allow me to chop my trees, please. So, probably after we get the power um, unit, I want to go ahead and be able to get the refiner and also the workbench. Basically, we are going to be able to craft absolutely everything crucial to the gameplay. Very important. We kind of give a look and listen here periodically. Surprised we're not seeing any chickens or anything. I may just go ahead and get my bow out. Be prepared. So, um, started playing a new game. Oh, I missed balls. Um, called Bermuda, and um, I'm really enjoying that, Bermuda Lost Survivor. Um, make sure, if you're watching my subsistence, go check out some of my other videos. Some good stuff there. Some pretty good stuff there, if I don't want to sound like I'm bragging to myself too much, but... Yeah, it's a thing. 
Galaxy Crate over here. A couple of them. Might have to make another lockpick when we uh, get a few more things crafted as well. Also, I will let you guys know that I am joined by Scout. He's being a very good boy and just hanging out uh, down on the floor, of course. He is too big to sit on my lap. Another shoddy. Let's go ahead and put that in. And we have a full load. Love it. Okay. Bear over yonder. Maybe we'll go over and find one of the lakes and uh, do a bit of diving for some kelp seaweed. Mr. Bear, see the crate. See some more lashing plant fiber guys. Some med plant. I wonder if that's a medical marijuana that's growing everywhere. <laughs> Sorry guys, had to get a sip of coffee, clear out the pipes. My cold is getting muy bien better. There's Mr. Chicken. There's a wolf fairly close. Let's go for it. And I lost that arrow. So when you hear that crushing sound, that <laughs> just don't even go look for it. It's gone. We will be needing some protein, however, so... It's important that we uh, get some chickens or rabbits or both. The morning is young, though. The day is young. The day is young. There, I spooked one. Medical plants. Let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, we have plenty. Let's make some cordage. And let's go ahead and craft a bunch of planks as well because we always need planks. And we will grind up some more trees and probably make some sticks. chicken over yonder, or bunny, it's a bunny, get a little bit closer, a boy boss, I'd like to get animal housing, but it's expensive to get, now should we go up top, yeah let's head this way, why not, why not, Grind up a few more trees. <coughs> Pardon me, guys. Still have a little bit of the cough going on. It's one of those doggone colds that could just literally last for two months, probably, my luck. Now, if there are any other YouTubers who are using OBS to capture this game, let me know in the comment section if you guys are getting the flashing, because it, it seems to be at night. See, there's no flashing there. But it, when I'm crafting at night and getting into containers and stuff, it seems to flash. And I'm not really sure why. Bit of a mystery to me. Oh well. I'm sure I will sort it out eventually. This is the only game that does it on too. You know, I record a lot of different games. Let's go ahead and get our bow back out. Let's grind up a bunch of sticks. ABCs, guys, I'll always be crafting. We do have a good amount of wood back at base, so not worried about not having firewood. It's 
got a big concern tonight. I would like to get um, another couple of the small game animals in the bag. Any baddies? I'm not seeing any. There we go. Sometimes the hitbox is a little weird. More goodies. Yes. Wow, we picked up a lot. Mr. Bear is up there. We picked up a lot of um, Yes. Picked up a lot of nails today. which I am not complaining about at all. See another crate. On my test world the other day, last week I was playing, it's Monday morning by the way, you'll probably see this episode Tuesday morning. Um, I found three lot crates all really close to my base. I was, um, I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't know you could get multiple locked crates on your, uh, game at once. So, interesting. At least I found it interesting. I probably should have recorded it and done it as one of my little short, weird videos. Not that the, we the videos themselves are weird, it's the content. Hi, Mr. Bear. There he go. go this way. We shall go this way. Also playing another game that I will be bringing to the channel. Um, we'll probably, or we will be picking up the gameplay kind of mid-early game. But, um, it's server-based. It's called Out of Reach. And, actually, the Danish Thinker actually bought it for me. So, big shout-out to Danish Thinker. He saw it on my wish list and just said, Hey, let's play this game together. And he picked a good, good game. Um, Out of Reach has been around for a good while. But, for some reason has balls has never taken off I mean it is uh, it has aspects of I see a little bit of, bit of rust in it um, I see seven days to die because there's a the learning tree type of scenario um, I see arc in it um, it's just a really, really neat game. So, look for that. Um, we might... I'll have to give a DT. Maybe he'll do some episodes with me. Like I said, we're a little bit kind of into the game. Um, probably next update, we'll um, plan on... Uh, you know, starting over, and then I'll bring you guys in at the beginning of the gameplay, but it's complicated enough game that I really felt that I needed to learn it before I jumped in and started making Let's Plays on it, because I just didn't know enough. If that makes any sense to you? Get a little air here. This kelp is very handy to have around. We need to make the cure for blood poisoning as well as it is a great food source for your fruits and vegetables. I'm glad that uh, Cole Games um, put that in as a thing that you didn't just need food, you needed both um, fruits and vegetables as well as protein. Kind of a neat little twist on it. Can you shoot your bow under here? You can. Interesting. Maybe we'll have
have pictures someday would be cool. The underwater just looks amazing, by the way. All of that. Some chicken. Way over his head. Way over his head. He gone. Alright. We're not gonna chase the chicken. Oh. Okay. You can have that direction, sir. Here's the chicken again. Yes. Very boss like. Very boss like. And we need to get a garden going. There's another chicken. He's booking it. Never mind. Did he stop again? He did, or that's another one. There we go. Nice. I like you. That was a clear miss. <laughs> Thought he was going to break flat there, but he did not. Let's do some more wooding. Wooding. Wood chopping. Stamina is getting quite low. We're quite low on protein. Let's head back to base and see if we can get that up. Head that direction. Guys, I'm going to pause out, get us back to base, and cook up some grub. Be right back. Okay, guys, we're back at base. I'm cooking up some of that small game that we got. I threw some things in the chest, like normal. Let's go ahead and craft up some more lashings. Yeah, throw that fiber in there. We have a wolf right outside our base as well, so hopefully he's not too big of an issue. Get these guys eaten up. Some more food going. There we go. Okay guys, I'll pause out. We'll deal with him in a minute.